it's move-in day. We arrived yesterday and look at these cute flowers. We're gonna go set up and we'll send y'all some before and after. the full outfit so I've got my really cute Sam Edelman boots on I love these my favorite skirt from shop bar bones shout out to Carly my Katrina Bell it's super cute and really fun and then I have just this plain gray tank on and then my favorite gold leaf hair barrette I've got the Emily Saint necklace on the 80s dad chain this really cool gunmetal clasp necklace the Josie rhinestone earrings and then this cute little rhinestone spike. I also have a super cute gold leaf hair barrette and my favorite Katrina belt. This like will focus on your face if you click on it. This is my friends from Hottie Hood. Ooh, yes. They found me from my YouTube channel. How cool is that? We did, it was awesome. We're gonna go back and look at it again. Hey everyone, it's day three at market. It's Friday, it's gonna be a great day today. I wanted to share a little bit about my outfit details. I have these really cute Matisse boots from Alexis and Bolt. And I wear the evil jeans. This fun little shirt I got at the beach. Look who popped by market today. I'm either. <laughs> it's always a video. I was smiling. <laughs> Today's the last day at market. We've had a great day. We've met some new buyers and we've had some returning customers too. It's been such a great week. We've had so much fun and we cannot wait to come back for January gift. Hey everyone, hope everyone's having a great day. I just wanted to do a little recap video about my time at America's Mart. I've been getting a lot of questions like what is market? Who can go? You know, I don't even know what it is. So can you please explain that to me? So last year, America's Mart in Atlanta, they're a wholesale trade show. They reached out to me about being an exhibitor for the apparel show. So apparel happens about five or six times a year in Atlanta at the America's Mart building. It's this huge four million square foot building in downtown Atlanta. Um, every couple of months they do like a big trade show and it is wholesale only so you have to have business license, a tax ID, everything, be a registered business and you have to be registered with the market to be able to go. And this is where businesses of all different kinds like salons, gift stores, clothing stores, you name it, they're all going here to be shopping for their stores to resell the goods. So for me, I'm an exhibitor where I set up a booth to be able to show my jewelry to potential buyers. 
So it's a really cool experience because I'm meeting vendors of all different kinds. Now I have all these friends, like my market friends, which is so fun to be able to go see them each time. And we all chat with each other about which markets are the best for us and which are, you know, which markets we should avoid and all that. So it's been really cool meeting a bunch of different exhibitors, but the connections that I've made with retailers are insane. I've met some really cool people. I've picked up stores in California, New York, Chicago, like all these places that um, it would just physically be hard for me to travel up there and show my stuff in person So they're able to just come down here and look at everything at one time in one building So the apparel show lasts four days I typically do go down to Atlanta for a whole week just to get situated and make sure I have everything ready to go It's set up like a typical work day So I'll be working like nine to six every day and people will just kind of come through the market and I do set up appointments with some shoppers too so if you're for sure like wanting to buy something you can go ahead and set up an appointment with me so that way when you come shop um, I can already know what you're looking for and it'll just be easy to know and show you kind of everything um, Market's a really fun day, but it's also super long. It's not like a retail show where you're constantly like bombarded with people, you know, with retail people are buying on the spot. With the wholesale show, they are writing orders and then we ship the product the next week or however long. I should try to ship everything out within a week just to keep my customers happy and because I like to be able to produce things quickly so they can go ahead and start ordering. So it's a really cool experience and you think that people are gonna be leaving with like tons and tons of bags and so I would have to take a ton of products with me, but because they're writing orders, you really don't have to do that. So you just bring samples and so they're just looking at like a couple different pieces, which is really cool. And it makes packing for market super easy. The first video um, about market, you can go back and check it out, my June apparel market. That one, it was my first market, so I had to rent a truck to go every to take everything down to Atlanta. But now, because I've been going to Atlanta so frequently, I go about every other month now, um, I store my products and my displays with America Smart Logistics. So America Smart has a full logistics and warehousing team, which is super cool. So basically, I store all of my displays, like I bought extra chairs, tables, everything, my props, all that stuff is stored in Atlanta. So when I show up to my booth, it's sitting there in my booth on a pallet ready to go. So basically I just undo the whole pallet and I just set up my booth so I'm not having to bring a truckload in every single time. I do bring my jewelry with me every single time. I have suitcases because the jewelry does change from show to show depending on the season and what I have in stock and what I want to sell. So for me, it just makes it easier to just bring everything. I know some people bring everything every single show and then some people store everything and don't have to bring anything. So it's totally personal preference and some people are shipping too, but it just kind of depends on what's easiest for you. But the building that I've been exhibiting in the last couple of times is building three. It has a lot of the temporary booths in it. So there are four buildings with America's Mart and building three is like a giant building i know you've seen footage you can see you know the most iconic pictures from america's mart are from building three with the elevator the clear elevators going up and down and there's like 16 floors in the building so it's really cool there's something on every different floor there's fine jewelry there's prom there's contemporary there's men's there's literally everything you could possibly think of so for me i'm a temporary booth so i basically go and set up at different shows and I set up and pack up. And then they have permanent showrooms, which are people like Free People and Eileen Fisher and some of the bigger brands that you've heard of. They have permanent showrooms. So they're not having to pack and unpack for every single show because they're there year round. I get a lot of questions about what's my favorite part of market and I would definitely say it would be meeting new people and making friends. I could talk to people for hours, so being a vendor at America's Mart is just really fun for me. I love getting dressed up and showing, you know, my new pieces of jewelry off to future customers and telling people about my brand. It's really funny because a lot of people will um, not assume that I'm the designer and the founder of my company because I am so young. So when, you know, people say, oh, who is Mary Catherine? I'm like, oh, that's me. <laughs> people will look at my mom assuming that it's her brand, which is funny because she's like, I have nothing to do with this <laughs> except for I'm the unpaid intern and I come help set up at market. 
But yeah, I just had been getting a lot of questions about America's Mart. So if you have any questions about it, please leave a comment or send me a DM. I'm happy to talk about it. I've made, made a lot of really cool connections and made a lot of new friends. So America's Mart is just something I've had so much fun doing the past couple of times. I never thought I would be a vendor there because it's such a huge experience. You know, it's next level type of stuff for the jewelry business, especially wholesale. So it's been really cool and I've kind of had to figure it out as I go. And I've just loved kind of figuring it out. You know, I feel like my whole business is me just figuring stuff out as I go, which is the most important and the easiest way to learn. You know, sometimes I'm gonna make mistakes, but I have a lot of cool experience that I would never have if I had just never even tried it. So if you have any questions, feel free to let me know and hope you enjoy all the footage from this market. Thanks.